Now, something you're seeing less of in a classroom these days, pens and paper. They've been replaced by laptops, which are perfect for students to take notes, write papers, and email professors about why they're running late to class. Some of CNET's favorite laptops for back to school include this Samsung NPR 580 JSB 1US, or as I like to call it, the red one. It's gorgeous, as you can see, plus it's actually a really good value. It's less than $900 for a ton of speed and a built-in Blu-ray player. We also like this slightly smaller Lenovo ThinkPad X201. This is kind of the business student's laptop. It's super fast. It has much better battery life than the Samsung. And then, of course, these ThinkPads last forever. Now, if we're talking about laptops, we cannot ignore Apple's MacBook. This is basically the quintessential student laptop. Now, this is the 999 entry-level model. What we love about it is its multi-touch trackpad, which is really one of the best with its responsiveness. Also, it has these cool gestures, and it also comes with Apple's suite of photos and movie software that we've talked about before. Now, if you're not really looking for a full-size laptop, netbooks are still here, and this is the ASUS EPC 1005 PE netbook. Now, obviously, you can tell this is a lot smaller in form factor. Price also makes these guys special. Typically, they're under $400, and this model specifically, we chose it because it has an eight-hour battery life, and that's a lot. <laughs> yeah, on, on a netbook, too, so this is great stuff. Dude, that's a lot of juice. And if you are trying to buy a laptop for school, it's kind of like choosing a PC. You're looking for the power for the buck. You can get a lot of power in a laptop for under $1,000 these days, down to five or 600 bucks. But if you want something small, light, and powerful, you're gonna pay for it. Thin and lights are still over $1,000, so if you really want something portable, consider a netbook. And when you're looking at reviews, make sure you look for good battery life, like that eight hours on that ASUS, that is key. And once again, you want the built-in Blu-ray.